location let's hey guys welcome back to my channel it's mercedes so today i'm just gonna be doing my makeup i don't know it's not really gonna be a tutorial like i'm just gonna be talking and doing my makeup kind of like a talk with me talk while i do my makeup sit there and watch me do my makeup <laughs> so i don't even know what type of look i'm gonna do I don't know. I probably want to do... Probably going to do like a natural one. Because I have to go to the doctor. So I don't freaking know what I'm going to do. My mind is like really everywhere right now. I keep looking at my viewfinder. My bad. Let me look at the camera. My mind is just everywhere right now. And... I don't know. I've just been feeling like weird. I really need to situate. Okay, I'm at my boyfriend's house right now. So all my makeup that I bring to his house is like in my makeup bag. And everything is just everywhere. It always takes forever for stuff for me to find stuff. It's annoying. That's hell. I don't even know where my freaking um spoolie is. Okay, so my eyebrows are looking <coughs> My eyebrows are looking to hella ratchet. Cause I'm growing them out again. Because I fucked them up, like one time I was using my little razor thing. I don't know if you guys have seen my eyebrow tutorial. But I have the, like this razor thing I use. And I accidentally like cut off the front of my eyebrow one time. And then they were just messed up after that. So I haven't been doing anything to them. Just wait for them to get hella thick. And then I'm going to be set. I've been hella breaking out because of how like stressed I've been and I don't even honestly don't even know why why I'd be hella stressed like I'm not in school I just work I don't go back to school till September why am I stressed out you know do you guys ever get like to that point where you're just like stressed out or like not in a good not that it's like a bad mood but like I just be feeling down sometimes and I don't really know why like I don't know my family's good everyone's healthy boyfriend's good my boyfriend's family's good like I don't I don't know my friends are good I don't see them that often though maybe that could be one of the reason is I miss my friends but I don't know like I'm 20 so I'm like in a weird age like I don't know if you guys experience this but I graduated like three years ago which seems fucking crazy because it feels like it was like a year ago and don't mind my hair I didn't do it yet um it's just it's just crazy it's okay that's not what this video is about um <laughs> so I'm 20 graduated three years ago so like half of the people I graduated with are like freaking starting families and they're married hella shit like they're fucking grown ups and I don't feel like I'm a grown up yet you know it's my mom I'm 20 I know you are not supposed to have all your shit together at 20 but you see like all these people on like social media and on TV and they're really young and they have all this money, they have their life together, all this nice stuff at and sometimes they're younger than than you. And it kinda makes you feel like like I saw this tweet on Twitter that was like social media is like messed up how we view like ages and stuff. Like you're supposed to have it all at twenty by the time you're like I'm not making sense but I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about <gasps> oh hell no no that's way too dark what the fuck I just fucked up my eyebrows can y'all fucking see that <sighs> let's zoom it in you guys fucking see this I fucking oh my gosh wow I'm about to do my brows off camera real quick and then I'm gonna turn the camera back on okay Alright, so I'm done with my brows. This is the best they're going to look for now. Oh, gosh. Yeah, I don't really like how they came out today. Ooh. 
I'm like breaking out because I've been, I've been freaking stressed out. Like the past week, I have not been feeling good, which is why, I don't know if any of you guys noticed, but I haven't really been on like social media. You guys probably haven't noticed because no one fucking pays, like who, who the fuck cares? Mercedes. No, no one noticed. But anyway, <laughs> anyways, if you did notice, uh, that's why I've been like distant and to my friends. That's why I haven't really been trying to hang out. I only got teeth whitened. I'm just putting some NYX color corrector on my red pimples that are fucking ugly. This one right here. Yeah, I've just, I always break out, this is my problem area. It's like my cheeks. But if you haven't noticed, that's why I've been like, not really posting a lot on social media and stuff. Because I've been sick for like a week. Off and on. First I had food poisoning. And then, I started having like, problems with my stomach. And I still kind of have problems. That's why I'm going to the doctor today. So yeah. And I'm not pregnant, okay? And yes, I know for sure I'm not pregnant. People always, whenever a girl says her stomach hurts or something, people always like, oh, you're, are you sure you're not pregnant? You think you're pregnant? No. No, bitch, I'm not pregnant. Like I was saying before I turn off my camera, being 20 is such a freaking weird age because you feel like you're grown, but then you're not grown. You're not considered a teenager no more, but then you're still treated like a kid. It's freaking annoying. It's just annoying how you can, like, go into the military at 18, but you can't fucking drink. That's stupid. Like, that's another reason that I've been, like, feeling down. Like, I can't freaking go out. Like, I need to go out with my friends, but we never can find anything to do, like, when we want to, like, party. No one freaking throws parties around here anymore that we know, that we know of. So we never freaking find anything to do. Everyone flakes and we end up not seeing each other. But uh, my boyfriend always, uh, he goes out with his friends. He's 22, so he could go to like bars and clubs. It just sucks, I can't freaking go. I'm just sitting at home hella bored and depressed. <laughs> But that's been bothering me lately. I can't freaking... I'm not trying to grow up fast, but I mean, I'm already fucking I'm damn near grown. But I can't wait to be freaking 21. Like, when I turn 21, I don't know if I'm going to vlog that because I might be too turned, but I'm trying to go to Miami, so that's going to be fun. Oh. oh, I need to get my nails done. They keep breaking. I've been using my, my real nails lately. So right now I'm going to do my eyeshadow. I don't even know what the fuck I have over here with me. I have my 350, oh, 35B palette actually. And then I have my Modern Renaissance. So which one? But being 20 is just freaking weird. Being three years out of high school. It's... Hold on, i got to get my makeup wipes. Like, there's some people I was in high school with that they already have, like, a freaking career job, grown-up job. Then there's some people in college, like me. And then there's some people who have a family already and are freaking married. And then there's people who are like me. It's just, like, weird. Like, half the people I, I, I went to high school with are freaking, like, grown-ups, you know? And then the other half are young adults and it's just like a weird stage in my life because like when I go on Instagram that's all I see and I'm like what the fuck am I doing you know like I'm in school but like I'm being like impatient with school like I just want to start like my life already so I always think of like the days that I have my kids and I have all this money and I love my career. Trying to my tooth. And I want to like live. <laughs> I want to like be there in my life right now. And I think that's why I've been feeling down. Because I don't like where I am in my life. Like I'm like sh freaking stressed, broke, freaking a student, 
freaking working part-time jobs. It's just annoying. It's like an annoying stage in my life. I think I'm gonna do a new look. I'm indecisive. So right now I'm using a uh, red ochre in my Modern Renaissance palette. I'm just blending that out. This is gonna be like a long ass video. Uh, and everyone is like changing in my life, like freaking every to my family, to my friends. Like everyone's just getting older. It's just freaking crazy. Like, I really can't put into words how it is, like, how everyone's just growing up. It's crazy, dude. It's a life. Like, sometimes I wake up, or most of the time it's like it says I'm not at night. I can't speak English. <laughs> sometimes at night I just feel, like, down, and I tell my boyfriend, and he's like, you know, you shouldn't feel like that, babe. You can talk to me, da 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 but like he doesn't know like boys are like different they're not like emotional some are but not my boyfriend he's not like in tune with his emotions all the time like me so my boyfriend tries to help me when i feel down shit but he doesn't really know what to say or what to do i really have no idea where i'm going with this look you guys so just bear with me You know what I really want? I want the freaking, uh, the Jaclyn Hill palette. Because when it dropped, it dropped at like 8 in the morning or something, and I was asleep. Like, I forgot it was dropping that day. I didn't set an alarm or nothing, and I woke up, everyone was tweeting about it and stuff. So, I can't wait till that restocks because I heard it's bomb, and that the formula is different, and... The color range is hella, like you could do so many looks with just that one palette. I can't wait to get it. <laughs> and I'm still using red ochre, you guys. If you care about the makeup look I'm doing. I also want to try, um, I don't know if you pronounce it Juvia's Place, but uh, it's like black owned and stuff. And I heard the that's like the best pigmentation. I thought it was Makeup Geek, but I also heard it was, um, Juvia's Place has the best pigmentation, so I want to try theirs, their, um, one of their palettes. It's just, like, weird. It feels like I'm, like, talking to, like, a person. Like, I'm talking to my friend. You know, my makeup with my friends. That's what it feels like. I hope I don't, like, run out of space on my camera because that's going to be hella awkward. How does that look, you guys? <laughs> I look crazy with this freaking green shit on me. Crazy! Okay. So I'm gonna use the brush that comes with the Anastasia Monument Sans palette. So that is a mouthful. I'm gonna use the brush that comes with it, the fluffy part. And I'm gonna use Cypress Umber. It's the freaking brown shade. Right there. Right there. You know? I've also been like freaking lazy lately like I don't know like I just wake up and I don't feel like doing anything I feel like freaking laying in bed all day and my boyfriend feels like that sometimes too I mean boys are freaking lazy anyway but um well my boyfriend is he's freaking lazy I have to make him do stuff but we just be like laying in bed until like he has to work or something or I have to do something and I've been feeling like that like ever since my semester ended freaking that's why I I've, I've wanted to like upload twice a week during the summer, but I haven't been doing that, and I'm sorry, you guys. I'm I'm gonna try to start, but like my motivation has been like gone. I haven't been feeling like doing anything. Ooh, you know what I watched last night? I watched freaking um, Dear White People. That show's good on freaking Netflix. Like honestly, I feel like all white people should watch that just to see why black people get offended the way they do it's just a good show the episodes are short though i wish it was longer dude someone <laughs> at my boyfriend's house like i said someone can hear me and be like this bitch is talking to herself the fuck this bitch hella weird i didn't i miss my friends i need to go turn up with them i'm just blending the um 
cypress umber right now. Woohoo! And then I'm blending that back out with uh, this is the Morphe G17 brush. I always forget to say what brush I'm using when I do like makeup tutorials and stuff. It's like uh, doing videos at my boyfriend's house better because my family is freaking loud. Like I have a baby brother at home who's loud. My house is not that big so like you'll hear everything. And he's always freaking like talking and yelling and crying. And then my mom is loud and then my brother is always playing music. And then my dad just has a loud voice so I always do my videos here when I do the videos. Most of the time. And I'm just always at my boyfriend's house, like it's summer, so I'd rather be hanging out with him than at home bored by myself. Like when I'm by myself, I just, I feel like I'm wasting my time, like it's summer, I should be out doing something. Maybe that's why I've been feeling down too, is because my life is so boring right now, like, like I don't do shit, I really don't do anything. I'm going to Vegas this month. And I'm going to be so bored. I'm not going to freaking be able to do shit. Like, I don't have a fake ID. Everyone's going to be going out. Because we're going for my boyfriend's mom's birthday. What am I doing right now? We're going for my boyfriend's mom's birthday, so... No idea what I'm going to do. I wanna, I, I'm want i just going because I want to celebrate with them, obviously. But then I'm like, what am I going to do the whole time? You know? I'm gonna eat. <laughs> that's what I'm gonna do. Hopefully one of his cousins comes that's under 21 because freaking I don't know what I'm gonna do. I might vlog that too if I if it's if it's a good vlog like if I do fun stuff but if I'm bored the whole time and the vlog is boring I'm not gonna vlog it. Ooh maybe I might do like a video I don't know like some type of video out there like not a vlog something that will entertain me. I kind of want to get like another piercing, but I don't know what piercing. Oh my god! I need to get my second hole re, re, re pierced. Maybe I'll do that. If you don't know me, I don't have any tattoos yet, and I want to get one. I just don't know what to get. That's why I haven't got one yet. But I really want a tattoo. Damn, this is a long ass video. You know what I heard? Um, I'm gonna start cutting my crease. Cause there's just if you live in the Bay Area, like um, like near Concord, there's a place in the Concord Mall, a makeup store, and they sell like Morphe and Juvia's Place, and they sell like the Makeup Shack lashes. I forgot what it's called though. But it's in the Concord Mall, and I want to go back there to buy some, like, Juvia's Place makeup since I never tried it. So I'm just using, um, LA Pro Concealer. Dude, it's like $2.99, you guys, if you find it at a beauty supply. I feel like I say that in every video. But I'm using the LA Pro Concealer, and I'm cutting my crease. I kind of wanted to try... I don't just want to do a half cut crease. I'm just something different. Maybe I'll look at my phone for inspo. Some inspiration. You guys, look. I got the iPhone 7 now because um, my phone company sent me the 7 on accident, I guess. They are supposed to send me another 6S. But I got the 7 in the mail, so it's mine now. So I freaking... I never told you guys what happened to my phone, but... um. I get hella distracted when I freaking open my phone, but, um, I freaking had a life proof case, and we, me and my boyfriend were using it. First he used it, okay, we're hella dumb, you guys. First he used it, and it wasn't on all the way. Okay, I'm gonna try to do this. Look, this is what I'm gonna try to do right now. Focus. I'm gonna try to do that right now. Anyway, so, me and my boyfriend, we were playing with the life proof case. And he put it on his phone, and um, I guess he didn't close it all the way. I told him to make sure like all the sides are closed because it has like snap and close, or else your phone's gonna get wet. So hold on, I gotta focus right here. I gotta focus. Let me try to 
get closer so y'all can see what I'm finna do. I'm scared. I don't want to mess it up. Okay. I want it to be more round than that, though. Can you guys see? Damn, I've been on here for 23 minutes. Just talking y'all's ears off. Dude, I really miss freaking cheerleading and dancing. I used to be a cheerleader in high school. Cheer was my life. Cheer was, that's how I have, that's how I know like my best friends is because of cheer. Hey, it's lit. So I kind of just turn the brush as I go. It's kind of hard though. Damn, it doesn't look like the picture. Instagram verse real life. <laughs> But it's good in there. I'm gonna try to make it look like that though. Use my skills. Okay. So I need to make the circle at the bottom a little smaller. Shit, dude. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know how they made the circle that neat. Fuck, dude. Oh no, that's ugly. <laughs> that's ugly, dude. Oh, hell no. It's supposed to... I have to redo that. I have to redo my whole freaking thing. I'll be right back. Let me turn my camera off so I don't want it to die. But I gotta fix... Look what I just did, you guys. That does not look like the picture. This is all supposed to freaking still be a shadow. So I'm about to fix that and I'll be right back. Okay? Okay. Alright, you guys. So I did it. How's it look? Okay, I look crazy with this freaking green stuff on my face, but other than that, it looks good. I use like a skinnier brush that I found in my makeup bag, and that helped, and I just kind of went like that with the skinnier brush, and it worked. I don't know what this is called, like a closed cut crease, a freaking semi-half closed cut crease, I don't know, but that's what I'm going to call it. And the girl on Instagram, actually freaking ABH posted her. And her name is Taylor Baker underscore makeup. And she did this look. So yeah. Go follow her. Is she popping yo? What color should I put in here? I said I was doing nude. So what am I talking about? I'm gonna put I'm gonna put um tempera. I'm gonna put tempera. It's like the whitest shade in there. Get it. Woo! Almost broke my mirror. Dude, let me know if you guys like this type of video where I'm just like talking. I'm gonna link all the makeup if I miss anything I did, but um I'm gonna link it in the bio everything I used. But let me know if you want me to like talk to you guys about life, about what's going on with me. I mean, you guys can, like, ask me questions and I can air answer them in a makeup tutorial. Like, advice or whatever. I think that'd be cool. Yeah, let me know if you want that. I had my orientation for, um... I'm transferring, so I'm going to a university now. I'm going to uh, East Bay. It's in the Bay Area. And I had my orientation, like, a week and a half ago. And that kind of got me excited for school. But in order for me to graduate in, um... In two years... I have to take 16 units each quarter. And I don't know if you guys know, but quarters are faster than semesters. So I don't know what the hell I'm going to do when freaking school starts. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do videos. Hopefully, I can. I don't know when I'll be able to film. I'll figure it out. I'm most, I'll most likely still be doing... I'm probably going to upload like once a week. If you guys want me to be successful, you got to bear with me. Okay, so I'm going to be using tempura, tempera, tempera on this like flat shading brush from Morphe. I've been doing so good with like saving money. I haven't bought makeup in a few months and I used to buy makeup. That's like where all my money would go. So I've been doing pretty good with that. Then I'm like, uh -huh, I need some new makeup. I need some new stuff to try out. I'm going to mix it with golden ochre because I feel like tempera is kind of too white. 
Yeah, this is better. I like golden ochre. Yeah, golden ochre. I like that. Bro, you make like the weirdest faces when you're doing your makeup. Ay, ay. Ooh, 4th of July is tomorrow. I still don't really know what I'm doing. I know we're going to like family barbecue. But I don't know what I'm doing, like where I'm watching fireworks or anything. Maybe I'll vlog tomorrow, maybe. Since I have the 7 now, the camera's better. I wish they sent me like the 7 Plus though, because they have like the portrait mode and stuff. And, ooh, my hair. Lord, I look a mess. Whoa! <laughs> Dude, my hair's getting hella long though. Okay, whoa. Shrinkage, then a mug. I'm sweating. I think I'm gonna add eyeliner to this. I'm gonna put tempera on my brow bone. Ooh, should I do glitter liner? Oh my gosh, I think I'm gonna do glitter liner. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm gonna do, I think. That should be lit. Ooh, what should I do? Should I do like a pop of freaking purple in my inner corner? Let's see how that's gonna look. Let's see, let's spray it with some spray to make it more poppin'. Ooh, that felt good. Should I do purple? Kind of like that. I think I'm gonna add some. Uh, so I'm just using like the pink shimmery shade in the 35B palette, and I think I want to use also the purple one right next to it. Every time I go on Facebook. Someone else is pregnant. And now I'm like not even, I don't even get surprised anymore because like we're at the age where it's like normal. Like people who graduate like a year older than me, they're like 22, 23, 21. Like that's normal to have kids. So we're really getting old as fuck. <gasps> I like this. Do you guys like this? Can you guys see? Mm -hmm. Maybe I should leave it like this. I think I'm gonna leave it like this. No eyeliner. This is the Marc Jacobs one. I got it sample size from Sephora. So I'm going to be using, for mascara, I'm going to use the L'Oreal Voluminous Original. I always use this one and the primer that goes with it. On my lashes. I really want to go to Disneyland. I want to go back to Disneyland. I went in December, but that was before the new, um, the new Tower of Terror. Now it's like Guardian of the Galaxies one. That was before that opened. So it was when it was still like Tower of Terror. And I got to write that for the last time. But I want to write the new one. It's just like a six hour drive. It's fine. But I'm really excited to be going to school in the Bay Area. My parents wanted me to go to Sac State, but I'm like, I don't want to go to school in Sacramento. I don't freaking like Sacramento. It's fucking hot. No, I'd rather, I want to be in the Bay or I want to be in LA. Okay, so I put my hair up. It was looking crazy. I put my lashes on. These are Paris by The Makeup Shack. I've been wearing these. These are like the only lashes I've been wearing. I love them. They're uh, like wispy. Can you guys see? They're like wispy. I love the Makeup Shack lashes. They're really, like damn near the only lashes I wear. I've tried the Lash Firm. They're like a new uh, lash company. Theirs is good too. Cheap, good, popping. I said that kind of loud. But yeah, those are good too. But I really love the Makeup Shack. So to prime my face, what am I going to use today? So to prime my face, I'm going to use the Hourglass um, Veal Mineral Primer. It's a sample size I got 
I think because my points at Sephora. I don't know. But I really love it. I think the full size bottle is like freaking over $50. It's freaking expensive. But it works. It's hella bomb. It works hella good, you guys. Now I'm going to be using the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation because it's the only one that matches me <laughs> in the summer because it's kind of dark. Ow, that freaking hurt. I can't cover that shit. But my advice, if you're going through something like me, where you're like losing motivation, you just feel down, you don't really know why, is to talk to somebody. Talking to people really helps. I need to start talking to people more. I don't really tell my friends about my problems or anything. I don't tell anyone. I tell my boyfriend my problems. My parents. I talk to my mom. But I need to like talk to people more. This is a M439 brush. And now I'm going go in with a smaller one. This is the Morphe G1. I really like this foundation. Shit stays on. And in the summer, I don't really use stick foundations because they slide off and I sweat a lot. It's really hot where I live, so I don't got time for all that. Oh my gosh, that's so ugly. <sighs> I fucking hate having acne. And then you just put some concealer on top of that. Man, I'm really craving some Mexican food, but then I'm like, when am I not craving Mexican food? So now I'm going to use my Tarte Tate Shape as concealer, but it's a little too light, so I'm going to go over with, uh, go over it with my NARS one. Because I'm, I'm darker right now. Oh, I'm running out of this one. I really want to see that movie. Um, I don't know. It's called Rough Night. Yeah, I want to see that. I heard it's like hella funny. Hella, hella, hella. I want to start doing like sharp contours, but I always feel like it's not, it doesn't look right on me because, I don't know, I feel like it doesn't look right. <laughs> maybe the powder, my Allura Mercier translucent powder, maybe it like makes it, my skin look white or something. I need to use like banana powder. Yeah, I'm gonna try it with banana powder. But yeah, it does. It just looks unblended when I try to do like that sharp contour and I cut it with the powder. It does not look right on me. But I'll try it today. Oh my gosh, you're just gonna see a little red spot on my face. Can y'all see that? Um, I'm using the LA Pro BB Cream for contour right now. I go in with powder and liquid. I'm extra. So, that's what I do. If you hear kids screaming, it's like my boyfriend's siblings and his cousins, little cousins, are over here. Because grandma's babysitting. I don't know if y'all hear that. But they're screaming right now, so. Okay. So right now I'm going to set my concealer with some powder. Ooh. I'm going to use the Laura Mercier translucent powder because I feel like no other powder is as bomb as this. I really do. But I just hope I stick with what I've said to you guys. I hope I get my motivation back soon. And I feel like doing stuff and being productive. Because it sucks that I start feeling like this in the summer when I have all this free time. And I just put it on my smile lines because uh, it creases right there when I smile and stuff. This is the Physician's Formula Multicolored Bronzer. It's like my favorite bronzer right now. 
and it's at Target and Walmart. It's a freaking drugstore. Go get it. It's like all these shades. This is a wet and wild blending brush, but it's like a big one, and I'm using it for my contour. Oh my gosh, I really want to go to Disneyland. Hopefully, I get to go to Disneyland in August. Because I also want to go to uh, BeautyCon. Let me know if y'all going. But, um, yeah, I want to go to BeautyCon LA. And then go to Disneyland too. So hopefully, I can afford to do that. So you gotta make sure you really blend this out. Because it's not going to look right if you don't blend this out. So I'm going to use a like pointy brush like this. It's a Morphe brush. Oh, it's the M431. I'm going to use this brush. Is it? Yeah, M431. I thought that's M439. Okay, I'm like, there's already a 431. But I'm going to use my Bahi Cosmetics Cody highlighter right here. And I'm going to highlight my nose. Tip, the smaller you make this little dot, the smaller your nose looks. FYI. So now I'm going to dust off my powder. And I'm going to use... I'm going to use this Maybelline Fit Me. It's, an, it's a little lighter than my skin tone. And I'm going to add this powder while I'm dusting off the translucent powder. almost done this was fun though I liked just talking to the camera not acting like I was perfect I don't like acting like I'm perfect when I do makeup tutorials like you guys see how I fucked up the first time I tried to cut this whatever this is called like I'm not perfect I just like to do my makeup so yes that's that what the hell? I'm gonna add some powder I'm gonna bronze my face a little bit I really think my forehead's peeling. It looks freaking weird. Like, under my foundation. And I was in the sun yesterday. I went to a water park, so maybe that's why. Maybe. I'm sweaty. As fuck. What should I add to my lower lash line? I'm gonna add... Hmm... Oh, this would be cute with blue. I think I'm going to add this blue right here. Uh, is that going to be cute? Yes. I'm going to do it. Just see what it looks like. Just see what it looks like. Oh, yeah. I like that blue. So I just added the blue shade. You guys see that? I like it. Yeah, that's cute. Okay. And now I'm going to add some mascara to my lower lash line. My mom keeps calling me, asking me, did I go to the doctors yet? And I'm like, no, I'm doing my makeup. And she's like, girl, where's my mascara? She was like, why didn't you go yet? And I was like, um, still doing my makeup. And she's like, are you serious? How does that look, you guys? Okay, so I'm going to do my highlight. I'm going to use Bahi Cosmetics again, the same highlighter I used to highlight my nose. I'm just going to spray some Mario Badescu, uh, this is a cucumber one, the spray, facial spray. spray some on my face you guys see that highlight though
diamonds are not the one shining with ya. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, so for my lip, I'm going to be using the Kylie Cosmetics Literally Lip Gloss. And then it's like this freaking NYX lip cream. It's dark burgundy brownish color like this. But the name and everything is like faded. It just says T-U-L-S, number 12. So I'm going to use that to like go around my lips. Kind of like lip liner, but it's not lip liner. You know why I get wow, wow, wow. And then for setting spray, I'm going to use this Morphe Prep and Set setting spray. And then I'm going to spray some more Barrio, <laughs> Barrio Mario Badescu Rose Water Spray. so long all right y'all hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you guys want to see more videos like this where i'm just like talking chilling and it's not like an actual like makeup tutorial where i have to be like professional and stuff i mean i don't have to be but yeah um i just talked a lot in this video so it's probably gonna be really long so watch this video when you have a lot of time and you're bored and yeah so I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, you guys. Thank you for watching. And if you made it through the whole video, comment down below and tell me what you think. Give me advice. We can give each other advice in the comments, you know. <laughs> so, I'll see you guys later. Bye, you guys.